On any given day, there's an estimated 1,100 homeless people on the streets of downtown San Diego, next to businesses, homes, and restaurants. It's a sad sight inadvertently made worse, police say, when we give to those holding up signs asking for help. Police Lieutenant Deborah Farah works with the homeless outreach team. People want to give, and what happens, though, is that when they do give, uh, that encourages more people to do more panhandling, and sometimes it gets very aggressive. It can be intimidating, too, she says, to visitors and businesses downtown. Chris Michelle is in charge of the Downtown San Diego Partnership Group. If we're going to end homelessness, not only in downtown, but in the other areas of the city, we have to get involved. About 300 businesses and several hundred property owners are supporting a first-time effort to raise money for homeless programs. The Make Change Count campaign uses converted red parking meters set up at a variety of locations downtown to accept donations. So you don't have to worry about where your money is being spent. Michelle says it's modeled after a successful program in Denver. So they reduced panhandling in their downtown almost by 80 percent. And raising the funds helped get more homeless people into programs they were previously turned away from. Lieutenant Farah says this is a great example of a public-private partnership. We know it's not going to be used for alcohol or drugs or you're not going to be scammed. 100 percent of donations will go directly to programs and services to help in homelessness. Dwayne Brown. KPBS News.